This is the Dan Levator Show with the Stugats Podcast. Chris Cody, <laughs> I cannot tell you how much, okay? I'm leaving here with a giant smile on my face. Pretty, pretty good show. Uh, because Jimmy Graham and Sam Morrell are looking into our shipping container, and they think suddenly it, Ben Franklin is the new executive producer. <laughs> of, of Neither of them show. said anything. Uh, so. No, this is what I love. They're both looking in Chair here. Chair ages you. <laughs> They're both looking in here. You do bear here. a resemblance to a former AP. <laughs> how, can, how can no one see you and comment? Where's my schmuck? <laughs> can, can I get you? I, I want to try this. I'd like for you, you to first? do this punishment more to see if at any point anyone oh, I mean. comments on you not on the center of our show being an 80-year-old founding father. But The time of our lives. The other thing I wanted to get to that, Billy, I don't know where you stand on all this, but this really backfired on David Sampson because I think my favorite moment of today's show is David Sampson ceasing and desisting, bringing a lot of lawyer talk, and Greg Cody somehow undermining him with a single bidet up. And just crippling his <laughs> argument, and every—I mean, it was stunning There's to watch. There's nothing you could do after it that. It was stunning <laughs> to watch a single bidet. Up, Greg Cody, you've coughed a lot. You owe fifteen dollars today. What? Uh, you owe Jessica fifteen dollars. Why? Yes, because you've coughed into the microphone. <laughs> Why do I owe her money? Sorry. Because all of the money is going into the fine bucket. The fine bucket was stolen. Uh, I then won the fine bucket. And as part of the grid of death punishment, I just said she get all the money here because someone around here stole the rest of the money. But not forever. Right. I mean, that no, just until, ended until then. Until the next person pulls it. Well, then there's no more money. I know. If she gets it all. I know. And then I, well, will, have been five. The, and I will have been the only well one done, who Greg. suffered. Yep. Here you because go. Here's five. I was the only one who was fined. Yes. Mm. So the, I will, because someone stole the money. I take the hit for the entire company. Well, I rule with an iron fist, and that's not the way it works. It's, it's yeah. basically as soon as you pull it, you get whatever money's in there, and Thank then you, it Billy. starts accumulating for the next person. To but pull I it. offered like, on a day you weren't here ruling with an iron fist, I offered because I thought it was wrong that she was getting no money because it had been stolen by a fellow employee. Who stole it? Sorry. I don't know. It's a good question. I don't know. Sorry. You don't have cameras around here? Security cameras? Hmm. Because someone here stole the fine money, I decided that my future fines and all future fines would go straight to Jessica while I was the one in the owner of the fine bucket. Now I own the fine bucket, and the next person that comes along will start fresh. There will be no money in the fine bucket. No. And then we're just repeating the problem. Uh, right. But someone's no, the problem is that someone stole the well, fine bucket. Well, that's another problem. Yeah, that that's an independent problem. problem. Yeah, One that no we should offense, look into. Yeah. Yeah. Look, historically, not the way it goes, but go for it, man. Bring a polygraph in here. Chris, I would like for you to do the show again this way tomorrow. I'd I rather we don't do that. Big Joe Harper. Bring him back. <laughs> Uh, what was the best one that looked most like you? Because Ben Franklin, there were a number of videos. Larry that... David, I'd say. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this Mark Hockman is pretty good. Time of our lives. I don't know where this I came from. But this, look, this is the new executive producer. Look, your new this, oh, could be, I mean... this could be your new character. New executive producer, Mark Hockman. This could be... <laughs> <laughs> and this is the way to do it. Wait a minute. Well, I mean, time of our lives. Schmuckums? That's all you got, huh? It's his Instagram story. Yeah, That's all I have. I By the way, I mean, you said Chris looks like something. It'd be really helpful if you guys said looks like yeah. suggestions because our tournament starts in like two weeks. Yeah. Oh, my what? God. I saw this. We've it is, a, no it is a leap year, though. We've got oh. no chance. What? You have an extra day. Yeah, I do. It's not me. Hours. Who's in charge of that? That's going to be a rough crew. Nope. Are we going to even be able to do this after the Super Bowl? Well, it was think... sold, so we're doing it. Oh, I had another God. idea for oh, the no. tournament. What's that? All-time guests on the show. Cool. Well, All right, was... you're in charge of that. Well, like it was that. sold. Yeah. All right, I mean, we just need to do a tournament. Yeah, okay. <laughs> of looks like of a hundred jokes that Adam McKay and Mike Sure haven't been able to write ones that are good enough to get in the tournament. You think that's going to be easy to do in two weeks? Well, writing Chris, comedy. Chris wants to do favorite guests. I yes. think he just said. No, I'm just throwing it out there, guys. I'm just saying. It's it. a good we, idea. We've been doing the same thing for a bunch of years. Our right. all time guests, top seeds, two Got seeds. Like, I yeah. think this is how you put your imprint. You change it. Mm hmm. To the one that's not sold. But dress like that. <laughs> All you have to do is dress like that. The thing that we never got to that I'm bumming about that we never got more to is, Chris, Chris, we've got a genuine problem with your father. He's got to cease and desist. He's not respecting it, but your father is in litigation now. Right? 
lit, there's litigation involved in Greg Cody and this conflict with Metal Arc Media. Hee haw, three, ba damp. <laughs> That kind of thing. He landed it. Exactly. He, he that wins. kind of thing. You never know. <laughs> you never know. This is Inu, an unimproved Alevatar show with the Stugats. Gamble on by DraftKings. <laughs>